First of all, I want to say I'm very sorry to hear about your sister. When things like this happen, it can feel like you'll never be okay again. But here's some information about this situation that might be significantly beneficial. Number sequences and episodes of synchronicity happen in every life case scenario. I mean, they appear during happy times, tragic times, and times when you may feel totally stagnant. The reason they show up is because you are being guided. They are trying to tell you something. And the question is, are you listening? Are you acting on intuitive nudges or are you ignoring them? These are some things to think about. With your sister's unfortunate passing, you experienced an ending, but endings always lead to a beginning of some sort. Now she's gone, but you're still here. So what are you supposed to be doing that you aren't? Is there something that you know you're supposed to do, but you aren't doing it for whatever reason? If that doesn't resonate, then consider this. When those number sequences appeared prior to her passing, you were being guided. Did you experience a situation during that time when maybe you mustered up strength and energy when you were in the depths of despair? Did you receive any divine wisdom or guidance that helped you in some way? Did you meet someone new? Did anything happen that changed your life for the better? Synchronicity doesn't just happen when things are wonderful. Synchronicity often happens when your life seems to be falling apart, but here's the deal. Sometimes things have to fall apart in order to get you to where you're supposed to be. So when number sequences appear and then something horrible happens, it's time to listen to your intuition. Your guides are trying to get your attention, but why? The only way to figure this out is to act on intuitive nudges, think about how you feel and what your thoughts are when you see those sequences and think about what might be brewing behind the scenes. Just because the future looks dismal right now doesn't mean it's going to stay that way. And more than likely, that's why you saw those sequences before her death. Is there a possibility that something you've wanted is coming for you? I want you to reflect on how you felt and what you were doing leading up to her death. A lot of people experience synchronicity before someone passes and the reasons and the meanings vary person to person. But what I know for sure is this, you wouldn't have seen those sequences if you weren't aligned with your source. Just because you experienced something tragic doesn't mean that you won't end up getting what you want. Some of the greatest miracles appear after our most challenging and painful times. So even if you don't believe what I'm saying, and I understand if you don't, think about these potential scenarios, okay? And I hope this helps you to build your awareness about synchronicity because an awareness will help you decipher the meanings when it happens again. <laughs>